Ranging from belly dancing to blues to tango, Yale is home to over 20 different dance organizations, each with their own signature styles. One group striving to leave its mark on Yale's dance culture is a breakdancing team called the Cerebral Addicts. I really wanted to impress girls in high school. And I feel like that's actually how a lot of like break dancers or like male dancers in general get started. Me, Michael, and Daniel, another uh, undergrad here, decided to start the organization just to start a, a, a scene that would basically support a breakdancing culture in New Haven. I think that was lacking before and we're trying to uh, encourage that now. Given the nature of the dance, team members have said that their team has a close yet lax dynamic. As their group has grown, they have expanded the number of performances they do and have even begun to compete in regional competitions. What brings us together mostly are the competitions because we all have the same directive even though we have different experience levels. We're not a very organized club, we're more like a bunch of people who like to just get together and dance. We're a really tight-knit family. Beyond simply dancing, the Cerebral Addicts say that breakdancing provides them with a sense of empowerment and cultural understanding. And when I started breaking, I felt really powerful. Now it's like become this way where I can express myself and speak to other people in a language that maybe they can't understand verbally, but they can understand emotionally. This is kind of a feminist plug, but there are so many just male breakdancers out there. I just think it's cool to see if I can do it. As the team continues to grow, it is eager to take on new members looking to bust a move and break it down. If you really don't need any experience, we're happy to teach anyone. If anybody and anyone can do it, you just have to stick with it and we're always hoping to have that chance to inspire others. On behalf of YTV, this has been Wayne Zhang and Rebecca Faust.